Hadi tukavisha, hadi sahi nisha tuwa pete. Uh-huh. Sahi sitaki maneno yake kabisa. Mali tuwa taniona ni kwa ITV. Hapo ndo mwisho. Mahari ulilipa? Mahari nililipa. Uh-huh. Ilikuwa 1.8 million. 1.8 million? 1.8. Ulitoa yote? Ulitoa yote. Kwa uni wapi? Kwa uni nyeri. Nyeri? Nyeri. Uliambiwa wamekwe sabia luto 1.8 ukamaliza? Walisema wa mtichana hamesoma, hameenda private school. Mm. Sijua so, mevunza maglasi. Soko yoyo yote na rurashio kakuja 1.8. Hata sijua venye nezo unge. Ati uki mundu wiki kila hatha akirai. <laughs> Unanijua kweli? Do you know me? Unanijua? Unanijua? Zino vitu ulipeleka kufanyo uko nyumbani. Baby, I'm sorry. Uwezi shika simu. Lafu na nitek sa subi hati huu, lilala mapema. Uwezi ndo vitu unendeleza huko. Ode, meandike anyway, you are still sitting there where I left to see. Ni hivu ndo uliandika jamen. Manisha hata something maybe went down. Mambo VP kama kawaida welcome to your number one online channel where we educate, we entertain and most importantly we empower guys. If you're new here, you know we do it like, subscribe and don't forget to share maze. And still 30 to 40 percent of us haven't subscribed. How I wish you can take this two to three seconds just to confirm from your gadget, from your friends gadget, from any supporting team around you as we continue entertaining and educating the whole society at large. Chukweli tu sekunde tatu tu msubscribe on your one and two and three asante ni sana. Anyway, mambo ni mengi masando machache. I told you this time we have to do everything up to the end. Nimepata vitisho lakini atubanduki, nime intimidatiwa, nime threateniwa lakini kazi. Mta kicheza kwa wanja tunawa expose. Mkiwa mzuri tunakuwa appreciate. We are just doing our job. We are not the ones cheating. And if you are cheating, just say you are cheating to see, to save time. Anyway, I'm with the gentleman Napa, you know him. After nime threateni wana letewa watoto uku, nini, nini. But I thank him, Amikuja, on the show. And he's ready to speak his side of the story. Maybe atatuambia amekuwa wapi, ama ni yapi, anaendelea. Ama what is he likely to do, ama what has he done. Anyway, karibu sana mkubwa. Santi sana. Hey, first of all, thank you very much kwa kuona kukuja. Mm-hmm. Ajua umeona tu vile nililetwa juu hapa na mke wako. Mm-hmm. Karibu ni uliwe hapa amenipeleka juu. Yaani umeshindaje? Acha tuanzie hapa. I mean, umeshinda vizuri. Mhm. Biblia ndio imekuwa ikinisukuma. Mhm. Ajua sitasema imekuwa easy, imekuwa tough sana. Mhm. Ajua ukicheza bwana ina kongo chungu kwanza kwa mwanaume. Mhm. Na vile tu sahi siezi lia mbele yenu. Mm-hmm. Lakini imekuwa very tough. But umekuwa at least unaomba you are keeping it strong. Yeah, yeah, keeping it strong. Mm-hmm. Mungu amenishikilia. Mhm. Biblia pia imenishikilia. Ndio nimekuwa nikisoma. Mm-hmm. Na imenisukuma sana. Imenitoa place mbali sana. Wow. Speaking of which, umekuwa wapi? U act wote bana. Siku tatu, siku nne tuja kuona vitisho tu ndio nimekuwa nikipigwa hapo. Umekuwa wapi? Hizo vitisho niliona, uh-huh. mbali nimekuwa sita wambia. Uh-huh. Nime kwa leo nimekuja tu kusema ni kusalama. Uh-huh. Uh, kama ni maneno ya madawa na, na, na kunywa. Uh-huh. Na ni kwa health ya vinyo mnezaona ni kwa health sana. Wow. Are you maybe communicating with your wife? Kwa hiyo sitaki maneno yake kwa sasa. Uh-huh. In fact, ni jana ndo nimepeleka divorce. Uh-huh. Na tutongea sa hile majaji za tamua. Kwa sa hii, hakuna kisina kitu ya kumambia. Umeamua liwe liwalo lazima divorce? Liwe liwalo divorce. Hakuna venye imeji yangu bana imeshuka sana. Hmm. Hadi nilibidi ni change kanisa. Hmm. Hata tuishi. Maneno ya watoto itambuliwa na judges. Na nasema labda walikuwa na flat na uncho rogi. Una hmm. dhani ni ukweli? Sijui njo ropi ye, yes, sijui nani. Ndio kwanza na kushukuru sana kwa kunifungua macho. Mhm. kama si wewe singejua hii maneno. Mhm. Na hatuwezi jua kama Njoroge Njoroge ndo alikuwa wa kwanza ama ndo alikuwa wa tatu wa sita huko. So na kushukuru sana kwa kunifungua macho. Wow.
Mimi mm. si hezi sema mengi sana. Labda ukianza tu kwa utaratibu tu mke wako mlipatana wapi? Maybe ukitupigia tu picha kitambo ndio tuelewe ni mtu aina yupi ya huyu tuna deal naye. Mke wangu venye mimi ilikuwa namjua ni mtu wa kanisa. Mhm. Mtu faithful. Mhm. Mtu hapana maneno mengi. Mhm. Lakini sasa hivi venye namuona ni mtu tofauti sana. Ni mtu anataka kuwa bibi wa pili kwa sababu ya Prado. Prado ni nafanya anataka kuwa bibi wa pili kwa huu pia anaitwa Jenjoroge. Sijui Jenjoroge sijui nani. Yeah. So Sijui ni kama nimekuwa nikiishi na shetani mtu amenyamaza. Mm. Lakini sasa hivi macho yamefunguka. Ulimwoa hadi mka nini formally hadi mkavishana pete. Hadi tukavishana hadi sasa hivi nishatoa pete. Mhm. Sasa hivi sitaki maneno yake kabisa. Mali tu ataniona ni kwa ITV. Hapo ndo mwisho. Mahari ulilipa? Mahari nililipa. Mm. Ilikuwa 1.8 million. 1.8 million. 1.8. Ulitoa yote. Ulitoa yote. Kwa uni wapi? Kwa uni nyeri. 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 Uliambiwa wamekuhesabia tu 1.8 ukamaliza. Alisema msichana amesoma, ameenda private school. Mm. Sijui amevunja maglasi. Soko hiyo yote na rurashio tukakuja 1.8. Na ukamaliza. Na nikamaliza. Hey. 1.8 million. 1.8. Na sasa tilipa mdogo mdogo ati hata ulikuwa ulipe sijui 20,000 ukipata sijui ni. Hapana. Mara moja. Hey. Yo 1.8 ingekuwa nayo sasa hivi nilikuwa mbali sana. Nilikuwa nimeangusha ploti. Mhm. Mali kama hapa. Ploti nyingine ya maana. Mhm. Hey. So na mbona mm. labda watu watasema hata kibiblia wanasema na wewe ni mtu wa Mungu? Mm. It's important to pay forgive and give maybe a second chance. In fact, acha tani wasome verse 1 Corinthians hapa. Mhm. Leo nimekuja nimejiami. Mhm. 1 Corinthians 7. Mhm. Verse 1 to 2. Mhm. Concerning marriage life. Not for the matters you wrote about. It's good for a man not to have sex. Eh? Not to have sex. Mhm sexual relationship with a woman was to inasema but since sexual immorality is occurring each man should love sexual relationship with his own wife own wife bibi yako peke okay and each woman with their husband so pia natuambia kila mtu akwe na mtu mmoja uko na maneno ya watu wawili kwa wale wezi elewa kiingereza mhm kuna hapa wa Corinto mhm blango wa sita mhm kurasa wa kwanza na wa pili mhm nasema hivi basi kwa habari ya mambo yale mliyoandika yeri mwanaume asimguze mwanamke lakini kwa sababu ya zina kila mwanaume na awe na mke wake mwenyewe mke wake mwenyewe mke wake mwenyewe na kila mwanamke awe na mume wake mwenyewe kuna mali imeandikwa kuwe na bibi wawili watatu kuwe na wako mwenyewe mmoja ametosha wow okay. na huu msichana na hata simu umempigia ama hata mmejulishana m- hali ini kwa maneno yake sitaki kwa sasa sele majaje zotaamua maneno ya divorce ndio tutakuja tuonge. Kwa sasa sizungumze naye kabisa. Saki maneno yake. Na labda watoto hivi nini nini? Kama venye nimesema venye wataamua. Eh? Akisema mimi ndachukua watoto. Jo bado mimi ndo nawalea. Bado mimi ndo na provide. Hapo ndo nitamwambia, hapo ndo tutakuja tuonge, tuamue. Hmm. Lakini kwa sasa staki maneno yake kabisa. Na labda nikikuuliza pia familia yao wanasema vipi? Unajua mambo ya family lazima upigiwe simu nini nini. Jana kwanza nimeongea na shemeji ndugu yake. Mhm. Uh-huh. Alikuwa ananiambia 
kwa kuje tu malize hii maneno tuongelee kifamilia lakini mimi nisha make up my mind eh hakuna kitu ya kutatua hapa hapa ni state divorce zu watu wengi kwanza waliwachi kitu mm. wasemu mingi zilipigwa mm. watu wanasema wengine hadi wananichekelea nikipita barabarani na vile ni meja yangu imeharibika hadi nilibidi nibadilisha kanisa mm. kwa sababu huko nikienda wananicheka wanasema oh sijui nimeshindwa kazi na kwa kweli sikushindwa kazi mchana nilipea kila kitu hakuna kitu alikosa na kwa hivyo maneno ni moja tu chatu wachane lakini watoto endelea kwa provide ya. Wow. Na labda uko na message gani kumhusu ama yenye unaweza mwambie hapo ukitazama kwenye screen juu ni papa hapa anaweza kukuonea. Ah uh, ile maneno niko nayo. Hmm. Ni kusema mwache kupiga simu kwa salama. Mhm. Dawa na meza nilikuja hapa kuonyesha ni kwa salama na watoto nitaendelea kuelea lakini kwa hivyo divorce the only solution the only solution jo hata ungekuwa kwa kiatu yangu sivyo tu ungefanya ama wa mara mingi nakubaliwa nisiseme kitu ah. ni kunyamaza kujudge ah. ama ku advise pale naweza lakini unajua kiatu nisichokivaa mimi mm. siwezi kielewa lakini wewe ni bibi yako na ni una mwelewa na ukiamua na itakupatia peace of mind juu wenyewe tulionayo mambo it's okay because at the end of the day you have to do what makes you happy it makes you comfortable otherwise thank you for coming that's all i can say just to honor you are coming and i really appreciate sana and uh, next time ata nikikupigia tafadhali kuja tu maybe tuonge 1 2 3 uh, tukijua progress juu pia ni muhimu tujue progress ya mtu vitu zinaendelea vipi na hiyo siku ya koti pia ukitaka kunialika unanialika mimi nione watamua aje na nakuambia mazuri so guys it's that's all for today see you when you see us till next time adios